Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Unusual Findings, uh, where we are trying to repair the train, or whatever it is, down in the basement. Um, you guys seem to be in the same sort of mind space as me, in that it seems as though to sort out this battery, it, it's like hinting that we can either make one or find and recharge one. Now I don't know if there is multiple solutions to this puzzle or something, uh, but if we have got to make one, um, I remember doing like a, a science experiment in school where you make your own battery um, and I'm pretty sure you use lemons don't you it's like the power source that you plug things into the lemon and, and use that so I don't know if we've got to use the lemon somehow most batteries do contain zinc so I imagine that might be a thing so that's making me think that maybe we have got to like make a battery plugging the cable into the lemon will not make any difference as it is okay so do we have to put the zinc in the lemon oh this is the beginning of something. Okay, yes we do. Alright, so can we... Not yet. I should connect one end of the cable to copper and the other end to zinc. Oh. And I'm missing the copper. Oh, we're missing the copper. Was was there a, a copper um, thing in the... Which room was it? Here, the geology lab. Was one of those little pyramid things copper? Gold? Oh no, bronze. I thought it might be. This metal pyramid is hovering in some kind of magnetic field. All right, so we. It has an inscription carved into it. It reads, "Enhanced bronze 32." So we need copper. Is that any sort of hint in here? Uh, copper. Gravitational fields. I mean, I don't think it's going to be to do with that. Laser gun. Zinc. anything about batteries in here? No. Right, so we're going to need some copper. Um, oh, is it, this is copper, isn't it? <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right, we've got copper. There's me looking okay. for copper and we've got copper. To be, to be fair, he did say we don't have copper and we did have copper. So I, I'm blaming our friend here for that. That's not on me, I say, with a slight smirk on my face because that was... Just me not observing. All right, so there's lemon with zinc and copper. It's a lemon with a zinc pyramid and a copper spoon on it. Okay. So does the cable go on it? Perfect. Now I have a lemon battery. We do. Okay, nice. So we've got a very safe looking battery there. So we might actually just be able to plug this in. Let's see. Uh, yeah, so there's the train. Wasn't the battery bit over here? Yeah, the engine. Okay, can we connect this up? Oh, we might be able to, you know. <gasps> yes, wow, that's really heavy. I hope this works. What the hell is that? It's a battery. It's a battery. Did you not go a to school? A homemade one. We are using enhanced zinc. Maybe it'll generate enough voltage. A lemon battery. Really? Yeah. It's Let a thing. me give it a try. It's a thing. Look, it's working. I mean, we just used awesome. it. Awesome. One less thing to worry about. Yeah. Um, you should be worried. Everything about this is pretty irregular. It's sparking a bit I'll as well. I'll keep my fingers crossed then. I just hope it doesn't run out of juice in the middle of the road. Hopefully not. Because it's a lemon. It's a terrible. It was fun. a joke. Come on. Yeah, awful. The energy doesn't come from the lemon. It's the metals that. It was a joke. Okay, I think we're back in control. Yeah, when we were in school, we did it to like turn a light bulb on. Um, I think we used a coin, like a, a like a two p coin or something as well. I can't really remember. I, I remember the lemon part and the light bulb, but it was a long time ago, so you have to forgive me the details. Um, are we so good? We are good to go, right? Yes. Just give me one second, and we've got the keys. We validated the, the train, train is ready to leave. Awesome. Nice. Cool. Yes! Alright, I think we might finally be able to get out of get this ready. area. We're leaving this place right now. Feels like being here forever. invading aliens by train? Not even in the twilight zone. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how long we've been here, episode number-wise, but Here we go. Feels like a long time. Oh, yes. Here we go. I wonder if we're near the end of the game, like, whether we'll 
get out and then there'll be like a boss fight or something like that. Is our that. station too far away from here? No. We should stop the train after passing the last lava pool. And when is that? I'll tell you. I was wondering, what if they send... Don't you say it. Why? What if they send what? Oh no. Can't Ralph just deal with that? Because of that! You don't remember the movies? <laughs> Every time one guy from the group is worried about something, it happens! Yep. Don't be paranoid. It was just bad timing. It wasn't. Stop arguing and get behind cover! It's the rules. Oh god, okay, Ralph's shooting. Runaway train. Cool. Can we die? Uh, Linda, do you wanna hey! speed it up? What's up? I don't know. Do you have any idea how to lose them? Do you have any idea on how to lose them? This is a train. I can only go forward. It's not like I can do an unexpected turn. You can break though, right? You can change the speed. Can you change the speed of this thing? I guess. Uh, can you go slower? Can you go slower? Slower? Yeah. Yes. Make them crash into us or something. No, they're about to hit us from behind. Okay. Do we have anything we could use as a weapon? Before we do faster, let's ask these. Do you have anything we could use as a weapon? I left my pepper spray in my purse. Can you lend me your high heels? I heard they could be a really effective weapon. <laughs> oh no, these were too expensive to let you throw them away. But we've got a giant robot on our side. Go ask him for weapons. He seems to have a weapon. Are we too far away? Are we too far away from our station? Kind of. Yes or no? I don't know. It was just after the lava pool. I mean, I'm guessing we can't see it. Can you change the speed of this thing? I guess. Go faster, please. Can you go faster? Okay, now going at full speed. Cool. All right, let's pull away from these guys. I hope this doesn't deplete the battery, though. I will try something. Okay. Good luck. Do any, does Tony have any ideas? He's the smart one. Hey, Tony! What? Uh, what are our odds of leaving this place in one piece? What are our odds of leaving this place in one piece? You don't want to know. <laughs> I do. Do you have any brilliant plans? Do you have any brilliant plans? No. I... I can't work under pressure. Oh, come on, dude. Uh, and I feel pressured when I'm being shot at. The best advice I could give you is don't let them shoot you. Wow. I will keep that in mind. Hadn't thought of that. Uh, why do you think Ralph's laser can't pierce through their shields? Why do you think Ralph's laser can't pierce through their shields? Stop calling it Ralph. It's a stupid name. It isn't. Okay, whatever. The big robot. Robot alien life form. Ralph! Ralph, yeah. Any idea why his laser isn't piercing the train shield? It's one thing to leave marks on concrete. It's a completely different thing to pierce metal. Ralph's laser is insanely strong, but not to that extent. Okay, so can we maybe... Give me a minute! Power it up somehow? Sure! Nick, any ideas? Nick! What? Uh, any ideas how to beat them? Do you have any idea on how to beat them? Do you have a firearm? No. Then Ralph is our only defense. And I hope he starts improving his aim, because it's not like we can lose them. Okay. What would the bull do? What would the bull do? Shoot him with Monica! Yeah. What if he were unarmed? Come on, it's the bull! He's never unarmed! <laughs> But I guess he would jump onto the other train and smash those guys. That's the kind of thing that works for him, but would get us killed, right? Probably, yeah. Probably. There you go, see? I think it's a good time to surrender. Do you think it's a good time to surrender? Forget it. I'm a good animal. We never surrender. <laughs> now that I think about it, I guess that's why the life expectancy in my family is so low. <laughs> anyway, we should not surrender. If we do, they'll probably kill us. Right. So I'd rather we think of a counter-offensive. The best defense is a good offense. Yeah, I hear that. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. 
Can we interact sure. with, like, anything on... We've got the train engine. Stop shooting us. We've got the train controls. And we've got Ralph. Hey! Okay. Uh, I guess he's not listening to us. We do still have this stuff. Um... Can we do anything with the train controls? I really don't know how this thing works. No. Okay. Can we do anything with the train engine? The engine is working as intended. We cannot. I mean, can we... We've got a spatula still with the thing. I mean, I don't know if we can, like... A long, silly spatula will not make any difference there. I mean, I wouldn't have thought it would, but you never know. Lava pool and train tracks. Who the hell built a train track over a lava pool? I mean, it's pretty cool. I get it. Alien technology. Let's have a look at the lava. We must be really deep. There are no volcanoes around. Mm, okay, no volcanoes. I mean, I'm guessing we've got to use an item there. Can we, like, lob any of the eggs at them? I'd rather not. No? Rubber oven mitt. I, I guess maybe we've got to slow down. Hey! What's up? Uh, can we slow down? Can you change the speed of this thing? I guess. Can we go slower? Can you go slower? Slower? Yes! Just a little bit. I don't want them to hit us from behind. Fine. So we'll slow down. That'll get us closer. Um... Let's see, can we... I will try something! If we Good got... luck! If we got anything we can do items-wise here? Okay, so there's their train. The enemy train has a really strong shield. Okay. Ralph's laser beam can't go through it. So it's shielded. So can we, like, do anything to it? A long, silly spatch? No. Eggs? I don't think so. We, like jam something into the tracks maybe a long silly spatula will not make any difference there no okay so we've got the tracks we've got the lava there's some lights can we do anything with those they spared no expense when buying lights for this place can we do anything to the lights i will give this a try oh, we can okay potentially yes made it dark. How did that help? Okay, hang on. I will give this a try. Let's do it again. Okay, so it's it's dropping down into the lava. Maybe if we're going faster they'll be like they'll speed up as well or something. Hey! What's up? I don't know if we've got to, like, get it to hit their their train or something. Can you change the speed of this thing? I guess. I mean, we're definitely on to something. Can you go faster? Okay. Now going at full speed. With this spatula and the lights. So the only other thing we can really affect is the speed of the train. So it makes sense that this might work. I will try something. Either that or we'll, we'll like jam it up there and snap our arms off as it goes so fast. But let's see. I will give this a try. Mmm. We knocked him down. Okay, cool. So do we want to keep... Oh, no. Did that break? Oh, we lost it. Okay, well. I mean, that, that did help take someone out. Have they still got the shield on there? The enemy train has a really strong shield. Yeah, okay. Ralph's laser beam can't go through it. So his laser beam still can't get through it. Um... Can we... Can we do anything now if we slow down? Hey! What's up? Uh, can we slow down? Can you change the speed of this thing? I guess. Can you go slower? 
slower. Yes. Just a little bit. I don't want them to hit us from behind. I don't really know what effect it would have had taken out that one guy because they've still got guns and stuff. Uh, Ralph, can you? I will try something. Do we have Good any luck. other items that could help us out here? Got the oven. Man. I don't see how that's going to help. Ralph, can you? Hey! Shoot the shields through. Guessing that's a no. All right then. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. We're out of time anyway, so we will carry on with this in the next one. This is very exciting, isn't it? So as always, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons: Arcades Games, Wayne, Nate, Termini, Nardi, Paul from the Phantom Fellows, Lyle, Barry Aldridge, Hobo, Numinous, Cooperdom, Paul Leone, Flossy the Sheep, John Com Five Five Five, Chrissy, and Paul James. And I'll see you next time.